hello everybody welcome to a new video today we're going to show you how to connect um an electric stove to uh, to your power we have power here current from the uh, switch from the walls and it switches up there what you got to do you have to make sure the switch is off 100 percent when it's on you're gonna blow up your head gone dead i'm telling you we're playing with death here so electricity is something which is very essential to know and also when you're dealing with it you must be super careful first of, first of all you must wear your shoes that could help a bit understand secondly you have to switch off all the switch switches then you test after when you have uh connected the wires three you must have a circuit breaker in the house or in the place where you're working because anything goes wrong it's gonna save you or save burning things uh if you don't do that i'm sorry you're gonna be in trouble which i don't want you to be in trouble i don't want to see you in trouble so i want to see you alive and watch more videos from us uh okay guys so that's life this is your positive and this is your negative okay this differs from which which you get but sometimes you might find these cables the the wires are a little bit different from uh what they call uh from they are different from what they call from colors i would say colors are different colors might be different and you think that the every every time it's gonna be like that no it's not always the case you get me so but this time in this time when you find this we have positive negative we have neutral you get me sometimes you can find black is the positive one and also it's gonna be mixed with the different colors but in most cases if black comes with red in its chances are high that black is the what is the negative and the positive is red one the live wire and the neutral one is this one the third wire okay this is what they call the earth wire so that you have to understand all those three uh cables so now we're going to put them in here uh there are three we're gonna pass them in here uh, pass them in here you may as well open this but uh, i would not recommend that might require us to take more time and it's not good a good uh what a good a good practice to use your fingers all the time it's better use a pliers or something like that when you're dealing with power because it's a bit safer a pliers which is insulated so it could be a little bit safer than anything else okay so this cable gonna go the red one gonna go here on top you can see here on top then the black one gonna go here you can see here here then the neutral one's gonna go here so yeah that's the case there uh, then we're gonna have to punch in that into our things here let me get you here first let me i want to pass these cables down in this thing down here down here first then let me let me, then i'll come back yes guys our first task is done we managed to pass this in and this in and this in uh, three of these cables so what we're gonna do is we're going to connect one by one but one of them it's not is insulated uh, so so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna first try to put this guy here the neutral because he's ready and is in his position to take off the challenge um, neutral guy okay 
gonna go here I'm gonna force the neutral guy here but still I'm gonna I'm gonna force him here Once it's inside, what I'm gonna do, I've, I've got my machine here. I'm gonna put this and I lock him inside. Once I lock him inside, he can't go outside. So since he can't go outside, it's fine. That's super good, but I don't want him to touch anything else. Let him be there, okay, it's fine so now this positive guy also he has to go up here get me up up here you can see he has to be somewhere up here that's where i'm gonna force him but now i have to cut him somewhere uh that doesn't become a problem a lot uh like uh, it's too much here Is too much somehow. Yo, I cut him under. Nearly damaged my eye. So pull him here. I can also tighten this using pliers and roll this a bit. Touch here and roll this guy. For when you're rolling this, you might these wires are very, 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 very strong. So, when I put this guy here, okay, I expect everything to be working super fine. Okay, after putting this guy here, I also has to. rolls in and I'm trying to take him out here. He goes out. Simply means he didn't touch well. He was not touched so well. So I can take out this guy. Okay, I take out that screw. Then I force the guy inside again. And then I put him there and I put him there. Let me try to pull him. Yes, I'm pulling him. Yes, he's being held there. Okay, great. Okay, once we put that wire there, it's okay. So now we have a challenge. This guy is going here, but now he's insulated. So I have to take him, take this out to put it here. Uh, there's this place here to put him there. Okay. Okay. Two cables are done. I'm looking for the third one. So I'm going to take out the insulations. Insulators here. You have to chop it a bit by using a plier. Uh, which is not that easy. Let me chop it out guys. I come back. Yeah, guys, after that, we can see the place there. Where we're gonna put this, yes. I'm gonna soak it in. Side here. After putting it inside here, well, if it's in well, then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna screw this up. Once it fits in, I try to pull it out. If it doesn't go out, just know that it's fine. So, I'm gonna do a test before I close this. There's this one I have to close. Also, there's 
something else I have to close. Okay, once I test everything, if everything the stove is going on well, then I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna close up here. We done this here. If there's nothing gonna go wrong, then we hundred percent fine. Done. So let me come, guys. Let me go test the stove. I have to test the stove before they get. I get paid. I have to switch on here. Wow. I've switched on. Nothing has happened yet. Nothing wrong. What I'm gonna do? Remember, this is one. This is two. This is three. This is four. This is the oven, whatever. So, let me see here. Let me talk on one. You can see there's a light there. The lights are on. Switch off, lights off, lights on. I wonder if you can see it well. I'm gonna switch on one. Lights, let me be inside here. Lights on, you can see the light. The light is on. So I'm gonna wait for uh, the stuff to warm up. Uh, should warm up. Yeah, I can feel it's warming up. Uh, it's warming up, warming up. So, oh, this is good. The job is done, guys. I wanted to warm it up and if I wish I could burn something here. And you see, yeah, it's getting there. I can get something to burn for you. Okay, you know these stoves, they take longer to be red. But it's on already. The best thing to do, I don't have to burn. I think I should put on water. I'm gonna pour some water here. You can you can see that. Yeah. That's just proven that the stove is working. Thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to subscribe and see you in the next video. The only part I'm gonna do is just to I'll close that thing, cover it up, and but everything is done. That's the way you connect this stove to your power. It's a defy stove. Thanks, guys, and see you in the next video.